<laughs> well, today would be a great day to have an outdoor wedding. Uh, temperatures a little bit warm, yeah, a little, little humid, sticky. but you know what? No rain. Hey, these people forecast. are enjoying it, right? Yeah, absolutely. It's not stopping folks from, from getting out and about and especially heading to the coast. Santa Monica Pier right now just packed with people. That surf came down a little bit. We're still seeing that sunshine and clear conditions for now. That's going to change as we head into tomorrow. So it is going to be a little bit of a different picture uh, at the coast and in the valleys, pretty much everywhere you go as we head into tomorrow. Right now, temperatures still on the warm side. And we're talking about temperatures still uh, about 10 degrees or so above what they typically are this time of year. All this orange, these are 80s. We're seeing a few 90s out there, kind of highlighted in red there. 86 degrees in down downtown Los Angeles at this current hour. Satellite and radar shows clear conditions, but we're going to be watching this system moving into our area, bringing a few changes in the coming days. We have a storm that's expected to move on through your Wednesday and your Thursday, bringing scattered showers and the potential for thunderstorms as well. Better chance of seeing uh, some rain into the mountains, especially with the thunderstorms as well, into the afternoon and the evening hours. And we do have flash flood potential because this is going to be a slower moving storm. So as it takes its time moving over. We do have a chance of that. And also we have another storm sort of on its heels. So when we're done with that, it's sort of a one two punch. We get another one moving in as we head towards the end of the weekend. Putting your future cast into motion, you can see wet weather expected throughout the day on your Wednesday, even the potential for seeing some pop up thunderstorms throughout the day. And then we might catch a bit of a break, seeing a few spotty showers here and there, and then more wet weather moves in as we head through your Thursday as well. As we kind of put this into motion, we can see what's going on here. We have the low pressure system to the south of us. Now this actually already moved to Southern California, kind of wrapped around moving south of us, and it's going to continue to kind of wrap around in an easterly direction, moving to our area as we head into tomorrow. Then by the end of the week, it kind of moves on out. We see another low dropping down from the north. This will bring us the potential for seeing more showers as we head towards the end of the weekend. Highs for tomorrow are going to be a little bit cooler than what we saw today, but we're still keeping some 90s out there. 90 degrees for Northridge, also San Fernando, 82 in Simi Valley, and about 81 degrees in Santa Monica. Really comfortable along the coast tomorrow. We're going to see temperatures climbing into the upper 80s for La Puente, about 90 degrees for Chino, Ontario, and temperatures will kind of stay in the upper 80s for the most part, maybe a few 90s into the mix for most of the Inland Empire. Here's a look at your extended forecast. You can see unstable weather continues once we head into tomorrow all the way through next week. Sandra?